was that? Thank you so much for Candace. All right. Well, today I am joined by past the, the, the lead pastor of Christian Union Church of God, Pastor Lance Taylor. He's here to share details about their treats in the street event and what you can expect. So thank you so much for joining me here on Absolutely. Tony Country. Welcome. Thank How you for having you? us. <laughs> I'm doing wonderful. Awesome. All right. So I want to talk about the treats in the street event. So first of all, what inspired that? So um, I've been at the church actually today four years. And so a few years back, the pandemic had let up, everything, everybody coming back in. And some of our leaders said they're ready to go back to the trunk or treat stuff. And we knew being end of October, you know, that's fall festival time, it's mm -hmm. trunk or treat. And so we said, what if we did a hybrid, kind of a mixture of all of it? And so we decided we'd do both and we tried uh, putting trunks out and we did fall festival type games and we just come up with this hybrid idea and therefore we came up with treats in the street. So uh, we locked down the street beside our church and we opened it up with games and stuff and that's kind of just what inspired it. What, we can, what more can we do to get the community involved and have a whole lot of fun at one time instead of a small trunk vent and a, a small um, <laughs> fall festival? It's just put it all together into one big thing. Absolutely, and so you said you're celebrating four years. That's yes. Good. Well, today I am celebrating my three year anniversary. Okay, from uh, well, so congratulations, we there you go. Anniversary. Look congratulations there. to you, absolutely. And so this kind of, uh, when I was looking at the, the flyer and the, the event that you are putting on, uh -huh. it kind of remind me of Hallelujah Night. Did you ever have that when you were a kid? Yes. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so so it, it, is, it, is a, it is a play on, on Hallelujah yeah. Night, it is. Yeah. It, it is very much a play on Hallelujah Night. <laughs> absolutely, okay. And so uh, when and where will this event be held? Okay, so it's actually in uh, Ashburn, Georgia, and it's right by our church, Christian Union Church of God. And uh, the street address, the best way to get there, 711 Teresa Avenue. Okay. Um, and right there in our small town. So we are, the best way we tell everybody, we are across the back door of the high school. So Absolutely. you pass the high school, you can't miss us. Okay, okay. So tell me, how important do you feel it is for churches to actually have these events like this? Like, obviously, you know, I've been, I've been born and raised in a church, and I can remember how unite so how yep. important do you think it is to have these events i think it's uh very important alicia and my main thing is what i've been telling our church folks lately and even people in our community i'm very involved in the community there in ashburn and a lot of things i tell them is uh, the church has to be the for the forefront and in the trenches of loving and serving the community and so i think this is a way for us to give back and to do things and inspire uh i know for ashburn it's a way for us to inspire hope it's a night to everybody to come out put a big smile on their face um, um, that's why this year we're doing everything free except the food because we're bringing in a food truck mm -hmm. um, and snow cone truck. And so in that way for us, it's our way to give back to the community and just invite kids in, invite their parents in and have a night to let their hair down and just have a good time and inspire hope, inspire uh, love. Our uh, vision at our church is we're more than a church. We are a family. Mm -hmm. So we do everything we can to inspire a family atmosphere. Everything we do, it's all about loving each other. Those who may not have parents in the community. Um, maybe they don't have grandparents to love on. We, we try to fill that gap. And so that's what events like this are for that. And I think it's very important that churches do the same in their community and mm -hmm. other churches in our community yeah. is to get on board and do stuff like that for that reason. Absolutely. And now I heard you say that it, this event is free. So is there anything that we can do to help the church? Are you looking for volunteers or anything? And we'll always take volunteers. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we, we'll always take workers. Um, in fact, my, my sister is my children's pastor. And that's what she's, uh, when I told her we're going bigger and better this year for our third year. And she's like, uh, uh, what about help workers? Is like we're yeah. gonna we're, they're gonna show up we're gonna get them there and so uh, we do have other churches there uh, in the community that love to help but we're recruiting our very own church folks um, and we all, we usually just ask say it's a three hour event if you can give us one hour of your night yes. and go spend time with your kids we'd love that and so anytime people want to reach out and volunteer and help we would love it absolutely okay and so if they are if someone's watching it and they want to volunteer where can they find more information, how can they get in touch with the church? Absolutely. Um, so you can go on our Facebook page at Christian Union Church of God. Mm -hmm. um, and on there are our service times. Um, on there is all the information to contact. We have also have an email address. It's uh, We call our church KUKOG. Okay. Uh, for sure. It's, it's just been like that for years. But um, it's C-U-C-O-G dot Ashburn 
at gmail.com. So you can email, you can message us through Facebook and get a hold of us to say, hey, I want to help out or uh, maybe even donate. We're asking for candy. Um, we try to do all the candy there um, for the games and all. So if you want to donate candy or just give to the church, say, hey, we want to help uh, blow up this event. And so we would love to do that. Absolutely. And also inviting people to church as well on absolutely. Sundays. And you said Wednesday. So I'm yep. sure they can find that information on Facebook. Oh, absolutely. Right? We would okay. love to have anybody and everybody. It's going to be a uh, awesome event this year. We've got inflatables and we're trying something new. We're bringing in a mechanical bull. Um, and so we've got food trucks, snow cone truck, horse rides. One of the members of our church has horses. Horse ride. Uh, we have a uh, trackless train ride and we usually get our first responders involved. And so mm -hmm. they came and give out stuff. So it's awesome. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for thank joining you. us. And we'll have all this information posted on our website at WALB.com. But don't go away just yet. We're going to take a quick